Here's a couple of things I'd like you to think about if you're planning on installing a drop ceiling and uh, not installing a ceiling in the rafters. And that would be to avoid building it to where the ceiling joists actually are supported by the garage door header, especially if it's a 4x12. Most 4x12s are overspanned to begin with. If you have a 4x14 or a 4x16, that might provide you with a better system or even a 6x12. But uh, all you need to do is change the direction of the ceiling joists. And uh, again, this isn't that difficult to do, especially if the garage can, uh, where the span's going to be the same. You have a 20 foot by 20 foot garage then this shouldn't be a problem. If you have a garage that's a three-car garage, you're not going to be able to do something like this. But anyway, this is a simple solution to a problem. So consider using this instead of hanging anything off of the garage door header, especially if it's, all, if it's a 4x12, because it's uh, probably maxed out on, on its weight. Last but not least, don't forget to check out some of our home book packages. I put together some of our books so that you don't have to buy them individually and get a better deal this way. This is great for do-it-yourselfers. And if you're a contractor, don't forget to check out our book, 501 Contractor Tips.